Hi guys. Um, I was just gonna make uh, a video. I haven't made one in a while, and I have one reason is we whole new chapter in our life. We built a home and we sold it, and we sold it probably a month and a half ago, and it sold quicker than what we thought. So we um we are living in a fifth wheel right now, and uh, it's a little different, but um. I didn't want to lose touch with all the people on YouTube and all the people that create together and that I've worked with. So I just was going to show you a little tour of the little part of the trailer and see. It's kind of messy, but it's showing, you know, that I still get to craft. I got my little cricket. I got a few things, and we've been working on Easter stuff. But anyways, so we're living here in the fifth wheel until we figure out if we're going to rebuild or buy or what we're going to do. So, anyway, I was just going to show you a little tour to keep in touch with everybody so y'all come along and watch with me. Okay, well, here's kind of a view. Like, here's our front door. And you come in. And this right here is a little... Right here is a little, um... A little extension. It has a little leg and sit going down right there. And you can take it out right here and put it up so it won't be in the way. I can keep that out though for my little cricket table when I'm doing the scrapbook. And I got my little gypsy so I don't have to tote all of my cartridges with me. So I can just plug them right in right there. And then I have um, over here is the kitchen table which during the day, you know, it's a little different because I have to clean up, you know, more. I can't just leave it be like in my scrapbooking room. But I've got my table out here. I've got my laptop where I've been uh, getting some ideas off of YouTube. And the girls' Easter baskets we've kind of threw together today. Just made them a little... They wanted the buckets. They like these better little cheap buckets because they can hold more eggs <laughs> whenever they're Easter egg hunting. So they like that. And I got my little... Uh, turnabout thing here with uh, my scrapbooking some of them not all of them but <laughs> ones that I could fit to bring and yeah I just got my tote full of stuff I have a little down here I have a little cubby hole that I get to keep some extra little things in I keep my uh, some of my stuff in there and some little I don't know, it's kind of a throw deal that I can store some extra stuff in down there. And I, I'll just show you a little tour of the trailer while I'm at it. That's just our sink and our microwave and our stove. And a little cubby up there. A little pantry and then that's our refrigerator. And this over here is my corner. It has the little desk. My computer slash desk slash whatever and up here of course I had to bring my scrapbooks some of them anyways and so I store them up there and then there's a little cubby with my college books I do online college and over here is the couch area and my purse is over there but and then I just have up here, we use it for our pantry. And uh, just more pantry. And then my girls' school. Since we're on the road, my husband is a evangelist, a preacher. And so we travel around a lot. Just cookbooks and some other girls' school there. And um, up there... Up there is the door to my girls' room. They have their own room. They have bunks up there in our bathroom, and I'll do that at a different time because they've been playing all day. It's so been pretty. They've been running in and out. And uh, and you can probably hear them out there playing right now. They're <laughs> screaming and riding on their bikes. And in here is our my bedroom, which is a mirrored closet right here. And, well, I don't hold a whole lot, but you can see there that the, that's my closet and uh anyways you shut it in the mirror and that helps it not look so little in here and up there is we can keep our stereo system and drawers and then just our 
our bed here. Down here I have a shoe organization system that works pretty good. I keep the shoe boxes for all my shoes and try to label them. And then my husband's shoes. Then I keep my sewing machine down there in the corner if I need that. And I hope I'm not making y'all sick. I'm not a very good videoer <laughs> without my tripod. And uh, anyways, well, oh, and there were my roses my sweet hubby got me the other day just because it's so sweet. But anyways, well, I just wanted to kind of give y'all a little, you know, a little heads up on what was happening, what was going on, and I haven't posted anything. But at my, uh, at my mom's, I do have a scrapbooking room still. She has four rooms, so I got to use all my excess of all the other stuff and all my tables and all that at my mom's in one of her extra bedrooms because they have four bedrooms. So they have plenty and all my siblings and me are married, so we use that. So I'm going to give you all a tour of that when I get back home of how my systems are there and everything. But um, I've been enjoying watching y'all's videos and I hope you can stay in touch. And any cute, neat Easter ideas, y'all let me know. I'm trying to keep uh, some just ideas to do on Easter every year, like little things that you like to do. I'd like to know because I'm trying to set some with my little girls. I have two little girls that are eight and six, so we're going to have a good time. And actually, they're out here playing right now. You can see them out there playing. There's one of them. And the other one's out there somewhere. <laughs> she sees me there. Anyways, um, yeah. Anyways, well, I hope y'all have a happy Easter. And I will see you next time. And happy crafting.